The Survivor game will be available for users to test before it launches later this year, and Fantastic has promised to bring it back to Steam. The day before used to have the second highest wish list on Steam. However, it has since faded into obscurity as a result of being removed from YouTube and Steam amid a trademark dispute, but Fantastic isn't giving up. I can't believe why Fantastic thinks it can fix the day before's problems and get rid of a bothersome trademark that's keeping the title off Steam. Perhaps the game should be called The Day After or something. Anything to get the ball rolling quickly. Now according to reports, Fantastic plans to release the game on November the 10th as scheduled. And what's more, a beta test is planned for months beforehand. Finally, the company promised to make a big effort to reinstate the game on Steam. It's unfortunate that the day before's reputation has suffered as a result of claims that it is fake and that the trailer is largely empty and possibly plagiarized. These elements contributed to Fantastic losing the trust of many gamers. If the day before lives up to expectations or if the current release date is once again delayed, only time will tell. The day before beta has yet to be scheduled but it is imperative if the game is to impress and win back its supporters. The day before we're unfortunately joined abandoned in the regrettable category of games that are in development but don't appear to be coming out anytime soon, if ever. Drop your comments on the day before. Until the next one, boss out.